It's that time of year again when we cast our eyes into the beating heart of the peloton to pass judgement on the new team kits. Most of the time the changes are subtle, and this year is no exception. So with that in mind, here are five of the best. Our first team kit comes courtesy of I Am Cycling, whose jerseys change from dark blue to white for 2016. Designed by Swiss brand Cureur for Swiss team IAM, you'd expect a subtle, understated design, and with clean lines throughout, this kit doesn't disappoint. IAM Cycling finished last in the 2015 World Tour ranking, so they'll certainly be hoping for a more fruitful 2016. We were already fans of Cannondale's striking green and black 2015 livery. Now they've turned the green dial up to 11, we like it even more. The Argyle boys should be easy to spot in today's crowded peloton, and since much-loved clothing specialists Castelli take care of manufacturing duties, the quality should be up there with the very best. If his Tour Down Under performance is anything to go by, you'll especially want to keep an eye out for World Tour rookie Michael Woods. Astana's clothing design is a miracle of perseverance. There can't be many riders who'd voluntarily wear light blue and canary yellow kit, but the Kazakh team have stuck to their guns and it's finally started to grow on us. The kit is manufactured by Moa and features all the mod cons such as aero fit and tape seams. We're looking forward to seeing how Italian powerhouses Fabio Aru and Vincenzo Nibali divide up Grand Tour duties in 2016. We've always struggled warming to Team Sky's kit. There was loads of black, a couple of flashes of blue, and very little personality. Thankfully, in the final season of their partnership, Sky and Rafa have upped the ante by adding a bit more blue and white, creating a design that matches the new Pinarello Dogma F8 seamlessly. It may seem like a minor tweak, but it also adds a touch of personality to a team often judged as being fairly heartless, and for that reason, we applaud Team Sky for this year's livery. Team Katusha have also suffered a reputation as a rather drab and faceless squad. You certainly don't see many people out riding in their kit, at least not this side of Moscow. But the Russians are looking to change all that in 2016 as they try to win the war of hearts and minds with a new, clean, and dare we say friendly, image. Kit plays an important role in this, so the design has seen a full makeover, consisting of a simpler red and white silhouette and bigger, rounder, and somehow cuddlier graphics. Whether or not we'll all be racing out to buy Katusha kit remains to be seen, but it's a truly bold design and a welcome change for the Russian team.